How is it going guys? Thanks a lot for joining me for another beer review. Today I'm going to be looking at another beer I picked up from Modern Times Beer out in San Diego, California last week. Today's beer is going to be Attack Frequency. An IPA coming in at 7% alcohol by volume. They're using Citra, uh, Eldorado, Amarillo, and Raquel Hops in this one as well as uh, I believe Guava and Apricots. So, Sounds pretty cool. Um, really enjoy Modern Times IPAs, so super excited to try this one out. Wow, huge aroma coming off this one, just super juicy fruits right away. But um, yeah, uh, this one's sitting right at uh, a little over five weeks old right now, so pretty fresh. Um, pours a beautiful, super uh, hazy, juicy orange color. Um, yellowish orange color to this one, half a finger of a bright white head, a little bit of alcohol legs on the glass there, but um, yeah, really nice looking uh, New England IPA. The aroma. Mm, definitely getting that apricot and guava right away. A really, really juicy, uh, fruity, fleshy aroma coming off this one. And then like a, uh, I want to say something like a kiwi maybe, some sort of, uh, yeah like a pineapple for sure. A slight like a bubblegummy jackfruit, something like that going on as well, lychee, stuff like that. Um, really beautiful smelling beer, super super juicy almost in your face juiciness you know it smells delicious so uh, let's try it out cheers mm, delicious stuff um, really really good beer right away is getting a nice uh, citrusy uh, um, numbing kind of a bitterness across the tongue when you bite into a citrus fruit you know uh, to peel it got a pithy bitterness then some uh, citrusy like a uh, brightness as well like this tart kind of thing in the front of the tongue there but then it goes into like this really stone fruit forward uh, juicy kind of flavor spearheaded of course by that uh, apricot getting some like uh, peaches maybe some like nectarine stuff like that as well yeah definitely like a nectarine in the background there center of the tongue then it goes more into the, like the guava, lychee, uh, mango, like the exotic tropical fruit kind of flavors. Really digging that. But across the tongue, there's a beautiful like piney resinous quality to it. Yeah, all in all, very nice beer. The mouth feels on point as well. Front of the tongue with that bitterness that comes like a slightly sharp carbonation, but then it, uh, the sharpness right away fades into this really creamy, uh, soothing, uh, th uh, not thick, but like a really soft kind of mouthfeel. Um, really, really, really dig in that. So, um, yeah, as a rating on Attack Frequency by Modern Times, awesome beer, once again from them. Um, yeah, as a rating on this one, I think I'd have to give this one like a 94, 95. Let's give uh, give it one more taste. Yeah, 95. Very, very good stuff. Definitely worth picking up. Definitely worth uh, trading for. Um, right now it's drinking really well. Uh, five weeks. I don't know how it tasted uh, fresh, like a, a week fresh, but it's drinking really well right now. Um, super juicy. Uh, still got some of that hoppy pininess and stuff like that, you know. So, yeah, awesome beer. Once again, from Modern Times, let me know what y'all think of this beer. Any of uh, Modern Times other IPAs, if you've tried them. Um, any of their other beers in general. Um, yeah, really looking forward to reviewing the uh, Churro Stout for you and a few others that um, I've got lined up, you know. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. Please give me a like, a comment, and subscribe. And until the next time, cheers.